the wonder world of English. Today, you know, it is your English class. Now, let us begin our English class. Do you know me? I am your new English teacher, Sharmana. What's your name? Good name. Okay. Now, let us move on to the English class. Are you ready? Yes, very good. Keep your energy like this till the end. Okay. Okay, dear children. Shall we begin our class with a super rhyme? Are you ready? I can hear you loudly. Are you ready? Yes. Count with me. One, two, three. Start. Wait. Just remember one thing. You should follow the actions with me. Okay? Will you join with me? Yes. Very good. Okay. So, be ready. I'm going to start. Ready? One, two, three. Start. Just keep your hands like this. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Listen to the music and clap your hands. Do it all of you. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Listen to the music and clap your hands. Stomp your feet. Stomp your feet. Listen to the music and stomp your feet. Do you like this rhyme? Good. Then, turn around, turn around. Listen to the music and turn around. Once more. Turn around, turn around. Listen to the music and turn around. Jump up high, jump up high. Listen to the music and jump up high. Okay, well done all of you. You could practice this from your home, okay? Okay, my dear children, I hope you all have liked this rhyme. Now let us go to our English chapter. You know, our first unit is Seed of Truth. What is it? Seed of Truth. It's a story. It is an interesting story. I like this story. I'm sure you'll also like it. Okay. And in that Seed of Truth, our first unit, there is a, there is a little stories. Our first chapter is the worry. The worry. All of you take your textbook. There you can see the chapter, the worry. Let me read this chapter for you. All of you please place your finger there. Okay. And read after me. Okay. Ready? Are you ready? Yes. I will read it for you. Vithyatara was the king of Gandhara. He was a just and wise king. The king was fond of gardening. He spent a lot of time tending his garden, planting the finest plant, fruit trees, vegetables and crops. His people were very happy. The king didn't have children. As the king grew older, Everyone got more and more worried. Who would take over the kingdom after him? Now let us discuss what each line says. Okay? Keep listening all of you. Vithyadhara was the king of Ganthara. Vithyadhara was the king of Ganthara. Ganthara, the place. Okay? The king was a just and wise king. He was a better king. He was a good. The king was 
fond of gardening. He was much interested in gardening. He spent a lot of time tending his garden, planting the finest plant, fruit trees, vegetables and crops. He was much interested in planting trees. His hobby was planting and tending his garden, caring his garden. Okay. And his people were very happy okay, about him. The king didn't have children. He had no children. As the king grew older, as the king grew older, everyone got more and more worried. Who would take over the kingdom after him? Every people worried about who will take over the kingdom after him. Okay. And there are some questions. Let me ask it. Are you ready to answer? Okay, try to answer for these questions. What was the hobby of the king? Yes, you're right. The king didn't have any children. What will happen to the kingdom? What will happen to the kingdom? Can you guess? Okay. How will the king find his successor? Can you answer? Can you guess? Okay, let's wait and see. Now let us move to the second chapter, a proclamation. A proclamation. Have you ever heard about the word proclamation? Now let us read it first. And later, we can discuss about it. Okay? Are you ready? Yes. This is very interesting story. Okay? Keep listening the story. A proclamation. To find a successor, the king thought of an idea. He decided, I will distribute some seeds to all the children in the country. The child who grows the biggest, healthiest plant will become the prince or princess. They can take three months for it. The king ordered his minister to give a proclamation. Now have you got an idea about proclamation? What will be proclamation? Have you got it? Yes, it is. Notice announcement, is it? Yes. Now I will explain each lines to find a successor. What is successor here? The next king. Okay. The king thought of an idea. He thought of an idea. Who will become the next king? Okay. The king also worried about it. He decided, I will distribute some seeds to all the children in the country. The king will distribute all the children seeds of the plants. Okay. The child who grows the biggest, healthiest plant will become the prince or princess. Okay. You heard it? The child who grows the biggest, healthiest plant will be the king or, sorry, the prince or princess. Okay. This was the demand of king. This was the decision of the king. They can take three months for it. Okay. The king ordered his minister to give a proclamation. Okay. This is the chapter we are telling. And then, why did the king choose such a test to find his successor? Can you answer? Okay, my dear children, 
let us check what will happen okay let's wait and see you know i am asking you can you prepare the proclamation for the king vidyadara yes you can you can prepare it miss will help you first of all let us look what things should be take care when we are preparing a notice you may listen heading in bold letters notice is should be given okay and the second one date and place you can prefer any date and place place should be uh, the palace okay name of the person or persons who draft the notice it will be from the palace drafted from the palace who is the notice addressed to it is addressed to all the children okay you know what is the main idea or message to be conveyed you know that what is the message yes the child who grows up the biggest and healthiest plant within 3 months will be the king prince or princess okay right yes now you can prepare the proclamation yourself all of you do well and hope you all have understood this class and all of you do well okay stay home stay safe tata bye bye see you in the next class okay